Tan 185 is a true multipurpose multimeter. Its key features are the physical functions such as relative humidity, room temperature, temperature, noise level, and luminous intensity measurement. In addition, it offers a wide range of electrical functions such as 1000 volt DC, 750 volt AC, 10 amps AC and DC current, resistance measurement, audible continuity test, capacitance measurement, and relative mode measurement. There are also practical test tip holders for storing the test tips after use and for putting in one test tip from the top. The ambient temperature is measured by a built-in sensor and shown on the upper part of the display next to the relative humidity. The temperature of other media can be measured by the accessory temperature probe, which is a so-called K element that means nickel-chrome nickel. -chrome nickel. One more highlight of PAN 185 is the sound level measurement. In this function, the meter shows sound level from 30 to 100 decibel. The built-in light sensor is on the upper side of the meter. The rotary switch position looks multiplied by 10, means the displayed value has to be multiplied by 10, that is 1100 lux. After switching on the spotlight, this value rises to about 27000 lux. Current measurement with a digital multimeter is a hazardous task. The dangerous thing is that the circuit has to be opened, because the whole current to be measured has to flow through the multimeter. For voltages above 50 volt, this task can be dangerous and should be carried out only by a professional electrician. The rotary switch is set to the amps range and by pressing the function button we select AC. The black plug is connected to the COM socket and the red plug to the 10 amps socket. This device can measure maximum 10 amps because higher currents would blow the installed fuse. Before measurement, we have to disconnect all poles of the circuit. With a phase tester, we make sure that both poles are free from voltage. We recognize this by the fact that the built-in neon lamp remains dark. Then we disconnect the phase conductor. An alligator clamp helps to attach the test LED to the conductor more easily. The other test tip touches the contact of the circuit breaker, then we switch on the circuit again. Now the current flows through the multimeter and we can read its value in the display.